Well, hello and welcome to the vlog. It is still Vlogsgiving. I didn't actually vlog anything yesterday because I kind of just took the day off. I had all these grandiose plans to do all these things and I got some things done, but I just decided to like take a chill pill and do nothing um, for the rest of the day because I was pretty busy up until about noon. Um, so yeah, but I am currently in the car hence the seatbelt situation. I'm actually in my garage and I'm about to leave, but I figured I would check in, say hello, explain where I'm going and all of that. So I didn't partake in any Black Friday shopping. I actually bought a couple of things online that I just needed, nothing like exciting or, I don't even think I even got a sale on any of the stuff because it was just like necessity stuff. But I am gonna go over to Maple Grove. It's gonna take me about an hour to get there. It's, um, like 4.30-ish, something like that. And I like to either shop like really early in the day or like really late at night. So this is like my really late at night situation. Um, Cause let's be honest, I wanna sleep in, you know what I'm saying? And the dog actually let me sleep in today till like seven, it was amazing. So um, I am gonna get going there. I have a whole bunch of places to go to cause Maple Grove is like the Mecca of all of the shoppings. Um, so I am gonna go over there and run a couple places. Um, I'll show you guys like a haul or something when I get home. I will be bringing my camera along with two, so if it's like super, super dead, I might be able to vlog a little bit inside of some of the shops, but no guarantees, cause you just never know. And you know, it's like really people outside right now with all of the, you know, Black Friday extravaganza. So I'm gonna get going so I can get to Maple Grove in a normal time frame, and I think, I think the only, there's only like one store that closes at eight. So I'm gonna go there first and then mosey along on my way. So I won't get back till pretty late at night, but that's okay. Cause tomorrow is a day off too. So woohoo, yay Sunday. All right, I'm gonna go and I'll check in with you guys in just a minute. So I'm at Target and it's super late at night. It's like nine, after 9 p.m. and nobody's here. But while I was out earlier, Jody from Life's Organized Chaos I'll leave her links below. Sent me a text message and was like, hey, since you go to Target like every day, can you check your Target and see if they have these like little houses? I'm looking for four. So I was like, oh, heck yeah. Plus I was already planning on coming to Target today anyways. Hold on, I need to go down this aisle. Urgh, we're trying to make a turn. But my local Target only has two. So I'm gonna check in St. Cloud where I work sometime next week for the other two. But let me show you the houses. They're like the dollar spot, playground, whatever that thing is called. So let me show you what it is. So here are the houses in question. And I think they're like, you know, there's like a hole in the back so you can put like a little tea light candle or something. Plus I needed batteries. So anyway, that's what's happening here. I think I'm gonna go look for some other things because I've got a few other things on my list. And uh, if there's nobody in the aisle, I'll show you what I'm gonna buy. Cause this is like creepy. Oh, there's somebody down there, we gotta go. So fun fact about me, I see this, like this thing from Threshold every time I come here and I'm always like, I wanna buy that, but then I never do because I don't have any place to put it. And I'm afraid to put anything on my walls anyways. So it just sits here waiting for me to buy it every single time I come here. Pretty sad, huh? Because we all know that Target needs more of my money, right guys? Seriously. But like, they have such cute stuff. Like, I've been looking online. Ooh, ooh. Oh, I can't do this right at this thing. I think that's really cute too. It's like, totally like, my no color aesthetic. So yeah, I'm like hunched over my cart all funny. Yeah, I don't know. It's so weird being here when like no one's here. I feel like I need to whisper like a baby. Oh, there's somebody up ahead. I look weird. Okay, gotta go. All right, I just snuck down this aisle and I am not gonna buy this thing. Like, this is what it is. But isn't that so pretty? It's a big old lamp. It's so pretty. Plus, I like just de decorated my Christmas tree today, so. Oh, it's so pretty. I love like the, it's like mercury glass, kind of. It's like that crackle with the gold and the silver. Gotta mix those metals, guys. Gotta mix those metals. But 100 bucks, not too shabby for as expensive as that thing looks. Ooh, look at all the holiday washi. Got some pretty blues, snowflakes, glitter. Here's their green bin. 
some socks, poly berries, and some green. Yep, I'm pretty sure that I like have all of these. I think there's some just like plain gold. There's a child screaming. It's birth control, you guys. It's birth control. And a bear. The bear's watching the tape. Okay. So y'all, I like candy, but check this thing out. It's like as big as my face. Why would you need this in your life? What is this? Please bring your final selections to register located at the front of the store. Thank you for shopping at Target and have a nice evening. They're telling me to get the hell out. Um, it's 8.8 .8 ounces of chocolate. Why would someone need that? They don't. Oh my gosh. Oh, update. Found a whole bunch of houses in the um, <coughs> holiday section. So let me show you. But blam, look at all those. I'm glad I wandered around for a while. So Jody's really excited that she gets all her houses. All right, woo, you see Target back there? Yeah, <laughs> I made it out of Target with about five minutes to spare. Uh, got a bunch of stuff. But yeah, I needed like batteries and I got a couple gift boxes that I needed that were like smallish sizes. Um, yeah, just like random things I needed anyways. And I think I'm gonna go grocery shopping like sometime next week. I was gonna go shopping at Target, but my Target, like my local Target, isn't a super Target, so they don't really have like the best produce. So uh, I typically like to go to like an actual grocery store for that because the produce isn't the best and I feel like it's a lot more expensive so eh, eh. I mean it's convenient I'm here but um, I'll just wait plus I have a gift card that the company that I work for gave me um, for a local grocery store so I think I'm just gonna use that um, next time I go so yeah but anyway I'm gonna get home and as soon as I get home I will start the halls giving is that what this should be called I don't know, I was kind of thinking about it today and I'm like, should it be called Halls Giving? Or should it be called Shops Giving? Or Shoppings Giving? I don't know. I guess it just depends on what the mood strikes me when I actually upload this. So, let's get home. And then also I want to show you what I worked on yesterday um, morning slash early afternoon. I was kind of like posting on social media like a mad woman. So, I'm going to show you that when I get home too. So. Anyway, I'll be home in just a second. Three, two, one. So this is what just happened. Doyle's very excited about everything in here. He found the one thing that's, well, actually everything's not for him, but that's really not for you, bud. No. <laughs> Such a goofball. So I went to Home Goods, Marshalls, Target, uh, Williams Sonoma, and also World Market. So I'm gonna unpackage all of this and then I will show you all of the things that I got because Doyle obviously wants to see everything. He's like investigating every single bag. None of this is for you, bud. I know, it's so hard being a dog. I know. I'm sorry, buddy. None of it's for you. I don't think he approves. But he's very excited that it's on the ground, I must say. Okay, sorry about the weird placement. So this is all the stuff I got at Marshall's. We'll start over here. These are all like squishy, like squishy bottomed, hard sold slippers. These are a medium, seven to eight. Um, I'm actually kind of slating these like for my mom when she comes to visit. The extra large, my brother's like in between a 12 and 13 shoe, so um, those are for him when he comes to visit. Also, there were these, the Laura Ashley. Um, this one is a five to six. These are for Isabel when she comes to visit. They're smushy. And then these ones are like a nine and a half to 10 and a half. Um, I believe that Heidi is a nine, so these are for Heidi. So anyway, my floors are quite hard and I'm on a cement slab as well. So um, especially when you're here in the winter, it's like really hard on your feet. So I'm gonna keep these here. They're like for them to wear, but if somebody else comes over that's like 
a five six like they can wear these you know what i mean so i'm just gonna put them in my front closet also i got some little um little like grippy guys I got actually two pillows like this. I figured I'd just show one because it's totally redundant. And then also I got um, two, they come in a set of two. It's like a little kitchen towel. This is gonna be for an upcoming giveaway, so stay tuned for that. And then let's move on to the next store. All right, so at Home Goods, let's start on the left. We got some gift tissue. Um, this is pretty neutral. There's just some plain white tissue really hard to see sorry plain white tissue there's some silver like fleck tissue and some gold fleck tissue so I figured this would be good like year-round and then I got some star plates which I thought would be nice like for dessert you know like at the holidays or really just whenever also got another gift box a star box and then this was kind of a shape I was looking for as well so it's good to have on hand obviously I'm going to use this one for the holidays this one I could really use anytime and I like that it's like the craft paper I needed a bunt pan because I don't have one because I'm not a good baker but I am going to be baking something for Christmas time so I needed one and I needed one to be like a non-aggressive color and there was this like champagne one so I was like yep uh, that's coming home with me also for the holidays um I got these these are a set of six just napkins and they were only $6.99. I actually went to World Market before this and those ones there I think were $9.99 for a pack of six. So I wanted to kind of compare the prices and I got two sets of them just in case they get dirty. I also got this bin. Hold on, we should show you the actual thing. It says kitchen, kitchen spaces, a bin with lid. I actually wanna use this, um, it says you can use it in the fridge, but I'm gonna use it in the freezer actually. So I'm gonna use it with, oh, these. Um, I don't have like an ice cube tray, so there's two of them in here. And I figured this would be a great place to like store it when you're having people over, or having a party or something. And um, you know, the bin could be lidded and then also you can stack things on top of it too. Also, they had two of my favorite containers there, so I can't like, I just can't pass it up, you guys. Um, this is a great container. I take these to work all the time. Favorite. And then also, this one's like a double one, so you could put like something in one and something in the other. Um, if it's something like liquidy, I wouldn't do that, but say if you have like carrots in one and like broccoli in the other and you have like some ranch or hummus or something, that'd be perfect for that. I got this little friend. This little friend is going under the tree for somebody, but I thought he was so cute. So cute. Hello. I don't know what we should call him. He kind of looks like a Brutus. What do you guys think? Brutus? I don't know. But I like his stripy belly. It's very fun. Urgh. All right, let's move Brutus out of the way. He's causing trouble. And then I got this really cute, like, footed bowl. Very, very inexpensive. Let me see how much it was. Yep, $14.99. Not bad at all. Made in Portugal. It's got a little bit of detailing with, like, the little scallops on it. Or, like, grooves, almost. And I thought that that would look really nice like during the holidays you could either put like ornaments in it um what i'm gonna do is i'm actually gonna use it for food so i think what i'm gonna do is i'm actually gonna put like potatoes or something like really big that needs to go in it because it's kind of cool that's like higher you know and then i'm gonna obviously have like some food that's lower so i don't know i just thought that would be a nice little addition so that's it for home goods let's move on to the next store okay so here's actually the next two stores um i'm combining them because i only got a couple of things at every store so at william sonoma i just got the one thing i just got the year hot chocolate the year there wow hot chocolate it is delicious um i love this they also have a couple of other versions but their other one that i really like is the hot chocolate with like peppermint or like candy cane or something in it oh it's so good but i figured i'd go with the classic because i never finished them but they're delicious and it's like hold on let me open it and i'll show you what it is it's like legit a bag of chocolate shavings so you can mix it with water but you should mix it with hot milk and it's like zabomb.com so 
that's what I got over at Williams Sonoma. And then right next to Williams Sonoma is World Market. I got these little bamboo knot picks because I am planning on making some more derby kind of things for the holidays. And it was really close to the utensils that I needed to get. Um, if you guys know over here, sorry, it's like a hot mess. That's all my garbage, by the way. Um, my utensil bin has a bunch of these in here already that I got from World Market. This is another part of the giveaway. So um, I don't know when the giveaway is going to happen. I think maybe around the holidays, maybe after. I don't know. I'm like compiling a few different things. So um, I'm not really sure when that's going to happen, but it's got like a little like silicone baster brush. It also has a spatula and then like a little flipper and then a skimmer as well. So I figured that would be good. Also has the stainless steel handles. There's quite a few that I saw out in the world today that has road, had rose gold, and I was like, ew, no, thank you. We're going stainless steel, y'all. So that's it for these two stores. Let's go to Target. All right, so you guys already saw the houses from Target, so I'm not gonna show that anymore because they're like nicely packaged away for Jody. but I got some batteries. I needed 12 AA's for all of that garland that you see actually has lights in them, but I haven't lit them up yet. So I needed 12 of those. There's the pupper. Hey, Doyle. He's looking all sad. <laughs> um, so yeah, got 12, of, or actually I got 20 of those. So I'll just put the extras in my little junk drawer. I got this little ornament because I thought it looked cute and why not? And then I got this bad boy. This is from Soap and Glory, if I remember right. Right? Yeah, there we go. Flake Away. I actually just finished up my sugar scrub in the shower today, so I wanted another sugar scrub. I figured I would try this one and see how I like it. Got some doves for work on Monday. I got a couple of these boxes. Um, I don't, like, if I get more than one, I just kind of show one, because what's the point? Um, got one of these boxes of for some holiday gifts. Uh, I just needed, like, a smaller size. And then I got these, the Cheez-It Extra Toasty. Um, I heard that these are really good from Living with Landon on Instagram, so I'm gonna go try them because I love me some Cheez-Its. And I usually don't like the other flavors, like the spicy ones and stuff so i would like extra toasty though so uh, maybe i'll try those out uh later on this upcoming week so that is all the stuff that i got you guys okay i'm finally done with the haul like the mega crazy haul now i have to put all that trash in the corner right there in the garbajo um, I took out all of the packaging of all the things that I have actually shown you guys already. So yeah, that's kind of what I was doing in the middle of that because that kind of drives me nuts to just have like things around. Well, I always have things around, but let's be real. Like, ah, a disaster. But today I put up the tree. You want to see? Doyle wants to show you. Ta -da 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 -da. There's the FDE tree 2017. Hi, buddy. Um, I don't have a tree topper yet. I do have one sitting here, but it like doesn't work with it. So yeah, it's a seven footer from Target. I will um, post a link of which one it is down below for you guys. This dog is like all sorts of excites. I haven't put up my new um, pillows yet. They're actually on the floor right behind me, but I'll put those somewhere soon because I have to, sorry if I'm making you guys like really dizzy, um, this mess over here is going to go away um, tomorrow probably because I'm not going to mess with it tonight. I'm going to put up the chairs and the table that was over by the tree there, if that makes sense. So I'm kind of like swapping some things around. But closer look at the tree if you guys are interested. Ta -da -da. Should we like some fancy holiday music over this or something? I did, however, post on Instagram the kind of music I was listening to while I put the tree together. And um, there was a lot of people that messaged me back saying that that was hilarious and that I guess they like me more now. So I don't know. I was listening to some um, gangster rap because that just gets me motivated. <laughs> so if you guys ever listen to Pandora radio and you like gangster rap like if you don't oops, sorry um but if you do you should check out the channel hip hop barbecue 
it's amazing. And it's hip hop BBQ, not like a barbecue written out like barbecue sauce. So yeah, it's, it's pretty good. If you like, what they mostly have is like late 90s, like mid to late 90s and early 2000s rap. So yeah, it's really, really good. So I listen to that once in a while or if I have like a really large project like that, that's what I listen to. I didn't listen to Christmas music. I don't really like Christmas music to be honest. And there's more stuff that went up over there. Put up the stockings myself and Doyle, if you're wondering why there's two stockings, Doyle gets a stocking too. Right, bud? He always gets everything. Yes, he does. Oh, he's so excited about life right now. Oh, yeah, yeah. But it is like crazy late. It's like 1040. And uh, like the eternal debate, do I eat? Do I not eat? Do I upload this footage? Do I wait till tomorrow? I don't know. Oh. I wanted to show you guys what I was working on yesterday. Okay, sorry, I'm like so scatterbrained right now and my kitchen is a mess, but that's just gonna have to wait. So let me flip you around and let me show you what I was working on yesterday. Okay, so these things are what I was working on yesterday. Um, so yeah, there is a new collaboration between myself and Catherine over at Coffee Break Planner. So I did a video, um, the last video that actually, was it the last video? I think it's the last video that posted on my channel. So if you guys wanna go back, you can take a look. Um, but yeah, there are these cute, cute desks. Um, these green half boxes. So um, we're gonna do, or not we, but Catherine did a Emily's home and work or work and home bundle. I can't remember which one's first, but you'll see it. I think it's like tagged or like on the top of the um, page when you go over to Coffee Break Planner. I'll leave a link below as well as right now, everything's 40% off for the holiday weekend as well as Cyber Monday. So the sale goes till Cyber Monday. If you enter in the code EMILY40 at checkout, you get 40% off of your order. And then also if you already, already? If you order a $40 or more after the discount is applied, you can put in the code free ship 40. And then that's always active by the way. So if you ever spend more than 40 at Coffee Break Planner, you can always do that. So you can do two codes, one for shipping and one for product, if that makes sense. So anyway, in the bundle, you actually get two sheets of these. Um, one of these sheets as well. So the cute desks, I'm like so excited about that. Um, also, there is an option to customize the desks. If you guys can see, hold on, I'm gonna try to focus this a little bit better. There we go. Um, sorry for the glare, you guys. But um, the desk actually has my logo in it, like my YouTube logo in the monitor, which is kind of cute. You can do that for a dollar more. There it goes. The shelves, to be completely honest, are like my favorite thing. Like I love the desks, like don't get me wrong, but like these shelves are like my life. I am kind of obsessed with them. So you get the plain ones, but you can also customize the um, frame in the center um, for a dollar more if you'd like. And this is how I customized my sheet. So it has my logo on some of them, and then it also has a silhouette of a Sheba, which is Doyle, so I thought that would look really cute. So yeah, and then also in the bundle, you get a, this is my work um, sheet. You can obviously tell I use these all the time. Um, this is in the bundle as well. So that was what I was working on. Um, yesterday morning kind of all morning i feel like social media kind of like took over my life yesterday so yeah but i do have the um like this is all the stuff for the giveaway that i showed in the video so that's all like packed and ready to go but i'm going to be giving away everything on sunday at noon central standard time i'm hoping that this video goes live before that so you guys can enter however if for some reason you don't watch it before then or i don't get my little act together prior to then um what you can do is you can still get 40% off at Coffee Break Planner until Cyber Monday 2017. I don't know exactly when, like what time it's going to be closing, like what time like Emily 40 won't work anymore, but it'll probably be late into the evening um, if I'm guessing right. So anyway, let me show you er, my planner and how I use these because that's always like the most 
asked questions. So um, in the video I did, uh, like showing all of this, I actually put this all in there. So it was like a little bit of a plan with me. So um, here's my work. And then also I went to TJ Maxx. So yeah, and then Friday I put in that I was gonna put up the tree. Well, that didn't happen. I actually needed to pull this off and put it right here. And then I'm gonna do another one of these because I went like home decor shopping again, but I went to a bunch of different places. So I think I'm gonna like list all of them um, underneath the little shelf. And then my giveaway ends at noon central standard time tomorrow. So yeah, but that is what's good at the FDE house right now. So I just wanted to show you guys that too. So if you're like interested into like what I was doing yesterday, it was that, it was that. I actually tried to like lay down and take a nap. <laughs> did not work. Um, I laid down for like maybe 30 minutes and I just like couldn't stop like interacting with people on the social media. So that was, that was my issue yesterday, which was totally fine. So I was like, you know what? I'm just gonna like take a break and figure some stuff out. I wrapped a couple of packages. I have like a million more to go, but um, if you guys follow me on Instagram, you would have seen that. And also if you follow me on Facebook because I link my Facebook and Instagram together. So you can actually like, I share the either videos or images um, from Instagram to Facebook, but I don't do any usually I usually don't do any like Facebook exclusive images unless I'm doing like a giveaway to be honest. So I just, I like Instagram better, but I still see uh, most of the stuff that pops through on Facebook. So anyway, I'm gonna turn my computer on because, oh my gosh, <laughs> it's been a long day, even though I feel like I haven't done anything, but yet I've done like a lot of things, so. Yeah, but anyway, I'm gonna jet Doyle says goodbye to, even though he's, doing something back there. I don't know what he's up to, but um, yeah, I'm gonna go for today. Um, tomorrow will be the last day of vlogs giving. So yeah, whoa, my computer is like freaking out. Um, so yeah, tomorrow will be the last day of vlogs giving. So I'm hoping that I can um, get everything up like the same day if possible, but it just depends on when I actually uh, get my poop in a group and uh, figure it all out. So anyway, I'm gonna go for today, but thank you guys so much for watching. If you have any questions, feel free to post them below. Um, you know, feel free to subscribe. I am here when I'm here, and you can always catch me on social media too, and those links are down below. So hope you guys are having a great day no matter where you are, and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye guys.